mayonnaise is the only mayonnaise with clover cream. Made with love by Clover. Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Let's get your bellies pleased. As we mentioned, the Guinness World Record-breaking Clover Cream Mayonnaise is the only mayonnaise with dairy cream, making it extra smooth. And today we'll be making a delicious creamy cream cheese or pizza with a short rib. And if you'd like to get the recipe on your mobile device, you simply SMS the keyword Clover to 33650. It'll cost you one rand fifty, and those free SMSs don't apply. I love pizza, but sometimes it's quite long to make, uh, you know, the whole right. dough, etc. afterwards. So what if they've got a little snack for you so long while I'm busy with the pizza. How's that? Oh. That's quite thoughtful, isn't it? You are so thoughtful. So that dip that we're going to make right now is also, so I'm calling it a dip for you right now. This is exactly the spread that we're going to make for this pizza. How's that taste? Give me a second. No, you don't need to take that long. It tastes mm. good. Oh, that's so yummy. All wow. right, cool. So. Oh, it's also onion here. It's delicious. It is. So some mm. caramelized onion going in. And then I got some jalapenos. I like <laughs> lots of chili in this one. It's really good. And, then and they're not that burning, it's got all that flavor, all that tartiness in there, it's, it's delicious. It's not that yeah. burning at all. A mm. little bit of cayenne pepper, now this one, That's burning. the burn. There we go. A <laughs> little bit of barbecue sauce going in. Just a little bit. And then you got some cheese. <laughs> Can you get which one this way is? Sure, I'm just put some all of it in there. And you want to taste a little first or don't you want to? Oh, I want to taste this. I want you to guess what it is. Mm. Mm. This must be like a mature cheddar. Mature cheddar? That's the mature cheddar. That? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. Actually, What's no, this? you're right, you're right. Gouda, gouda you're right. No, no, you're right. This is the mochicha cheddar. That is the mozzarella. Delicious. Cool. And you want to blend it up for me? Cool. That's fine. On easy. There. We haven't overloaded the machine, have we? Uh-huh. Have we? I don't know. I don't think so. You can never overfull a blender. No, never. you can't. Let's see. And you know what? You'll, it will seem as if I've never used this machine before. Go. Push number Which two for me. Which one do? Number two. Yeah. Say when. When. Now we're going to add our clover criminals. Oh, I see. So all the wet ingredients now yeah, go Yeah, other way around. Ah. I know, eh? It's Friday. You see, my brain doesn't really work on a Friday. I'm just in it for the food. Aren't you? You're in it for the technicalities. I'm cool. in it for the food. Right, delicious. Blend it up. And the reason why we love adding the criminals, obviously, is because it's the only mayonnaise with actual cream in it. Done. So cool. let's talk about the pizza. So I've made my nice, beautiful That's dough, so nice good. and soft. Mm -hmm. My tip is if you don't have a pizza sauce at home, I just turn a baking dish upside down. Mm-hmm. And so then, let's do it right there so you can all see. It's been sprayed already. Don't worry about that little bit that's come off, it's fine. The bigger the turn, obviously, you can spread your pizza out nicely. So actually, let me cut it just like that. Yeah, cut this off, sir. Whatever, whatever size tin you've got at home, make your dough yeah. obviously fit that. I'll make this no. for you for to take home, maybe, yeah? Perfecto, senor. Right, I'm gonna cool. keep this on the side. Thank you. For myself. And then we just take this off. Let's spray this. So instead of doing a tomato sauce, I'm going to use cheese sauce at the bottom. I see. So Makes the cheese sense. is going to melt deliciously into that pizza. You know you get those delicious cheesy pizzas that you just want at home. This is a nice way to get that cheese to melt already into the dough. Yeah. This is a very cheesy one. Okay. So if you're a cheese lover, like Jeannie, she already came <laughs> to scout the pizza. So, <laughs> so she's going to be happy with this one. Then, short rib. I made some short rib earlier. Mm -hmm. um, we actually made some nachos using short rib a few weeks ago. Yeah. Same recipe. Nice and easy. We're just going to dot it all over the pizza. Pizza. It's gonna start melting and going super crispy because the short was already cooked. Nice. And then it comes out the oven looking looking like that. Like that. Just throw some fresh ingredients over the top. You could put a bit of rocket on there if you really want to bring in a bit of pepperiness mm -hmm. at the end. Maybe a bit of I don't know baby spinach. But I really like the idea that what you've used there is that coriander. Coriander no? and coriander. onion. Yeah, nice. your favorite. Very great. I'm not gonna offer you a piece. No, it's <laughs> lovely because it's got all that freshness on top of what already would be quite umami in the bottom. So you've done yeah. very very well with this one. Listen, if you do want to get all the details for this recipe, you can SMS the keyword Clover to double three six five zero. You can also get your kids involved in this recipe because it's a fun one to make with the whole family around the table. And if you've missed any of the steps, here's a quick recap.
Made with love by Clover. 